Okay, State Corral, Oklahoma State University is suing NMSU for trademark infringement over the school's mascot, Pistol Pete. ABC7 obtained a copy of the lawsuit. Josie Ortegona is live from our New Mexico mobile newsroom with that story. Josie. Rick, NMSU released a statement to ABC7 today, and they say they were surprised that OSU took this action. Students I spoke with agree they were pretty surprised, too. It's completely insane. I think it's a little bit ridiculous. I don't think that Oklahoma State has a monopoly on men with mustaches. A general consensus from NMSU students on campus, the lawsuit is... It's ridiculous. But after looking at both mascots, it's hard to deny they are strikingly similar. Yeah, well, that one's really similar, but yeah. our new one is not. The suit filed in an Oklahoma federal court Monday claims NMSU copied OSU's mascot. Both mascots are based on a real-life cowboy, Frank Eden, who was involved in a gunfight up north in Albuquerque and has Oklahoma ties. OSU has used the Pistol Pete mascot since the 1930s. NMSU adopted it during the 1960s. According to NMSU's website, they paid OSU royalties for using the mascot. OSU is asking NMSU to stop using the mascot altogether, destroy anything bearing the gunslinging logo, and pay OK State for any profit made off the mascot. Pete has gone through lots of changes through the years. In 2004, after 40 some years, his gun was taken away and he was dubbed Lasso Larry. A year later, Pete got his name and his gun back, but did go through a small makeover. That's why students say it's a little too late to come after what NMSU now calls classic Aggie. We already changed it. There's no point to do a lawsuit now. In a statement, NMSU says they are confident both schools will come to an agreement. Diehard Aggie fans hope so too. Lawsuits today are kind of just petty. We're Everyone's trying to find money in, in weird places. And MSU, as they hope, both schools will be able to continue to use the Pistol Pete mascot. Live at New Mexico State University from our New Mexico mobile newsroom, Josie Ortagon, ABC7. Can we all just get along for Pete's sake? Thank you very <laughs> much, Josie. Oh, that was good.